Well, you guys, today we'll take a look at the best PC protection you should know about in 2023. It's backing up your data. It's always been one of the last things that people do, and it always causes them problems because they don't have backups of their data. This is probably your best security measure you can do on your computer. There's plenty of free options available like Macrium, like also IOMI. We have other versions as well, which you can download. I've not listed them all, but there is tons of them out there which you can use to back up your data or even clone your drive. You can also create images of your data on drives. You can also back up all of your files and folders as well if you wish. And there is plenty of options available out there. So don't leave it to the last minute. Always back up your data on a regular basis. You can even use cloud storage like Carbonite. Uh, Backblaze or any of the other uh, cloud storages out there. There's plenty of them to choose from, and some of them are paid and some of them are free, depending on uh, what sort of storage you need. Now, if you don't need a lot of storage space, you can use uh, some sort of free storage like uh, Google Drive. They offer some free storage, and you've also got OneDrive, and there's a bunch of other ones out there which you can use as well, which are paid, which offer loads of storage for a very low price and this will keep the data away from your computer and keep it in the cloud now if you're one of these paranoid peats that don't want to use this method then there's plenty of other options available for you so we'll take a look at say macrim reflect because it's free now why does this keep your data safe and why is it the best protection for your computer well backing up your data protects you in an event of a computer crash. So if your computer crashes and you end up with some major issue, you can end up losing all of your data. Maybe your hard drive fails. If your hard drive fails, you have lost all of your data. And that means if you haven't backed up, your data will be gone and you will have to do expensive data recovery methods to try and recover your data from a, a failed hard drive. Now, there's plenty of more reasons which we'll go through in a second after today's video sponsor, CD Key Sales. If you're looking for a cheap product key for Windows 10 or Office, then check out the links in the video description, create an account on their website, and then choose your product. Once you've got your choice, you can go down to the Buy Now section, click Buy Now, and use my promo code, capital B, capital R, 09, and apply this to your order, and you'll get 30% discount. Basically, apply it and then hit the submit key. And then all you need to do, once they send you your product key, you can head over to the activation center and activate your version of Windows. So let's talk about the reasons why it's so important to back up your data and why still some people don't do it today in 2023. So let's talk about if you live in an area where you have a lot of storm activity, this can cause a lot of electrical outages, and this can also cause a lot of surges in your area. To your computer now if you end up having a lot of these issues happening in your area this can cause major data loss and you really are at risk of losing data so it's important that you back up your data on a regular basis to counteract any of these sort of measures or you have in place some sort of protection for this happening to your computer so let's talk about another common issue why backing up your data is so important and why still people today don't do it in 2023. We can talk about lightning storms. If you live in an area where you get a high amount of lightning storms and you do suffer from electrical surges or even electrical outages from the actual storm that you're suffering from. And if this happens quite a lot, it's important that you protect yourself with obviously regular backups of your data and you can also use uninterrupted power supplies which is a ups this will also protect your computer and protect your data on that computer as well as backing it up is so important now probably one of the biggest threats today to a computer is ransomware ransomware encrypts all of your sensitive data it's a malicious attack by someone who's put say for instance a ransomware in a link in your email or sent you a file or you're downloading some sort of software that you shouldn't be downloading and guess what happens you get hit with ransomware and you can end up with all your data being encrypted now how to defeat ransomware is simple you don't need any expensive software 
You don't need any sort of high tech antivirus software on your system to block ransomware. You just have to make sure that you have regular backups of all of your data. And this will defeat ransomware in an instant because all that ransomware is, is it holds you to ransom by encrypting all of your data. And because you have backups of all your data, it won't really matter. All you need to do is just do a fresh install of Windows and copy all of your personal files back over to the computer. And that person that sent you that ransomware has been defeated. And you have to obviously have a bit of an headache of having to reinstall Windows, but at least you're in the knowledge knowing that all your data has been saved because you used a bit of common sense of backing up your information in the first place. And it's that simple. It's so simple that a lot of people just can't compute it and obviously follow that through and end up, when they get hit with ransomware, end up with all their data being encrypted and they end up being held to ransom by a cyber criminal. And some people even end up paying the actual cyber criminal the money to release their data. And there's no guarantee that he will even send you a key to release your data. Now, if you don't need to back up the whole drive and you just need to back up a small amount of data, you can do. You can make small backups of folders and files. You can even upload small amount of data to, say, Dropbox or Google Drive or something like that where you get a free bit of storage. And that might be enough for you. You might not need to go uh, too heavily into backing up your data. But at the end of the day, as long as you've got backups, no matter where you keep them, whether it be on an external drive, in the cloud, on a NAS drive, or wherever it may be, you should have free backups of all of your data. This way, it protects you even more. Because if you've got free backups, it means that if something happens to one of those lots of backups, then you also have two other backups in reserve. And that is why backup is the golden rule of computing. Backup, backup, backup free backups and your data will be safe. Hope this video has been some sort of use to you. Uh, my name has been Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. Just want to say a quick shout out to all my YouTube members who join my YouTube members group. I really do appreciate the support. I shall catch you on the Discord server for a chat or I'll see you in the very next video. Bye for now.